We are here in the summer camp of the European Left Party to discuss about uh, platform workers and class struggles. Actually, it was very interesting because we, um, we understood that the, the strategy of the platforms are really the same everywhere and uh, the, the result of this is that uh, workers are um, precarious, very precarious and we are a lot of undocumented, undocumented workers now uh, working for these platforms. My message would be that the unions can tackle the platform work and for us as a union, it's clear that the platform workers, when they work for companies such as Ford or Walt or Uber, they are employees and should be regulated as employees and should have all the, the safety nets and the security that the employees are, have. We also discussed the international so, uh, solidarity and the importance of sharing best practices and helping each other and sharing information and learning from each other. All over Europe, uh, platform workers are fighting for their rights. Uh, in Portugal, uh, we have a, a, around uh, 100,000 platform workers. And government creates a particular model to uh, frame platform work uh, in which uh, there is an intermediary that uh, liberates the platform, uh, the platform companies uh, of all their uh, obligations as uh, bosses, as the responsible for the work. And uh, now we are discuss discussing a new law and we, we were learning uh, what is happening in the Nordic countries where the collective bargaining is the, the main mode of regulation but also the experience of intervention in France with the um, with um, the house of the uh, delivery workers and, uh, and the other uh, union interventions and we were also discussing uh, the contribution that the directive can give to this struggle.